Warning, the game in this Let's Play is rated M for Mature. Viewer discretion is advised. Welcome everyone to Kingdom Come Deliverance. This game has been out for a while, so it probably does not need an introduction. But real quick, it is about a blacksmith avenging his family. And I absolutely love this game, so I'm gonna play it. There was like a little history lesson before I got to this point, so I did record it. So I'll be playing it right now. Charles IV, King of Bohemia and Holy Roman Emperor, had a long and successful reign. The empire he ruled from Prague expanded, and his subjects lived in peace and prosperity. When the emperor died, the whole empire mourned. More than 7,000 people accompanied him on his last procession. The heir to the throne of the flourishing empire was Charles' son, Wenceslas IV, whose father had prepared him for this moment all his life. But Wenceslas did not take after his father. He neglected affairs of state for more frivolous pursuits. He even failed to turn up for his own coronation as emperor which did little to endear him to the Pope. Wenceslas the Idol did not impress the imperial nobility either. His difficulties mounted until the nobles, exasperated by the inaction of their ruler, turned for help to his half-brother, King Sigismund of Hungary. Sigismund decided on a radical solution. He kidnapped the king to force him to abdicate, then took advantage of the ensuing disorder to gain greater power for himself. He invaded Bohemia with a massive army and began pillaging the territories of the king's allies. It is here that my story begins. The early 15th century was a time of turmoil in the Holy Roman Empire, which had flourished under the late Emperor Charles IV. But now, with his son Wenceslas the Idol on the Bohemian throne, was falling into disarray. The king's inactivity angered many of the nobility, as well as his half-brother, King Sigismund of Hungary, who decided to take drastic steps to restore order to the empire. Well, husband, how goes it? Good. I should get it finished today. 
Where on earth is Henry? I need him to run some errands. He was still sleeping when I went out. At this hour? Blue-blooded idler. Well, it looks like he was out all evening, drinking like a lord. <laughs> Go and get the lazy bones up then. Quick clout round the ear should do it. Mm-hmm. Henry! Get up now. There's work to be done. Better not vex him. Now get up quick. Your breakfast is on the table. <laughs> Wait, what's this? Have you been... Oh, Henry. How many times have I told you about fighting? Oh, it's nothing. It's just a scratch. You've been at that sword play again, haven't you? You better pray your father doesn't get to hear of it. You know how he feels about it. Yeah, don't worry, it wasn't that. I just scratched myself, is all. Hmm. Well, just don't come crying to me if you really do get hurt. Now get up, you rogue. <sighs> A fine state you're in this morning. What on earth did you get up to last night? I'm back. I didn't really go anywhere. I just wanted to show off the whole game. That intro was beautiful, right? Okay, so. Make the screen bigger for myself. Okay. So this is choice base. A lot of the dialogue is choice base. So. Okay, I'm definitely going to go with speech. I'm going to focus on speech in the very beginning. It is very important. You will see why. Uh, nothing much. Me and the lads were just having a chat in the tavern. Some wayfarer stopped by. He was telling us what's going on in the world and, um, well, I, uh, I lost track of time. Well, I hope he didn't fill your head with nonsense. Well, I've got a feeling there's something you're not telling me. And it's connected with that scratch on your hand and that suspicious looking character with a sword who turned up in town recently again i'm going to focus on speech it is very important plus i just honestly i just think it's the better answer anyway you think he's teaching me sword fighting don't you what use would that be to me here I'm not lying to you, ma. Yes, you All right, then, if you say so. I don't mean to pry, but you know your father takes a dim view of such things. Okay. I think I can ask all of these questions, and I think I'm going to. Okay, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna ask all of the questions. I was just looking father at them. Father angry with me for sleeping late. He's not happy. Yesterday, you promised him you'd help finish that sword for Saratzik. He's not as young as he was, and you know how his joints pain him. He's too proud to complain, but he needs your help, Henry. I know. Don't worry, Ma. Of course I'll help him. Good. He always says his knees ache when there's a storm coming. I hope they're wrong this time. It's looking like such a nice day. Mm. Yeah, do that one. Do you need me to do anything, Ma? Ah, you're a good lad. But I'm fine. It's your father needs helping with that sword. Did Matthew and Fritz come looking for me? No, I haven't seen them this morning. They shouldn't be hard to find. They'll be hanging around a tavern somewhere, as usual. Yeah, I think, uh, 
this one I'm about to pick is the best answer. I think overall that you're misjudging them just is is better. That's unfair. Really? So where were you until the small hours last night? I was with Bianca, of course. You mean at Bianca's tavern? And who was there with you? No, don't tell me. Let me guess. Matthew and Fritz. Well, at least you were with Bianca. You should hold on to that one, Hal. She's a clever girl. And invite her for supper sometime. Your father's very fond of her. Yeah, of course he is. He thinks he'll be able to wheedle the secret of beer brewing out of her. <laughs> You're right there. You'd think he was planning to become a brewer in his dotage. Still, that's your father for you. At least he's interested in something, unlike you lot. You're too busy getting into mischief to do an honest day's work. If Fritz and Matthew carry on this way, they'll wind up swinging one day. You mark my words. Okay, that's the big one. Can I get something to eat? <laughs> I left some breakfast on the table. Help yourself. Okay, we're in there. Okay, so you discovered Scallets. Scallets is where we live. Okay. I'm using my PlayStation 4, but I'm looking on my on my computer screen and I, I'm not used to this, so bear with me. Okay. I actually forgot the controls. It's been a while. So just give me a minute. Okay, that's up arrow. That's that's the map of where we are. That's that's scallops. Okay, how do I get out of here? That's what I need to do. Okay, so. Okay, so this is kind of like the main menu. You will see my inventory on the one side. And my stats on the other. Okay, yeah, there's, okay, there's health, energy, and nourishment. Nourishment is hunger. And it's down to 40, so we do need to eat. Okay. Eat from pot. And now you will see. Now you will see my nourishment is up to 65. Now bear with me because I'm going to be hoarding all of the stuff in this room. You'll see why. Again. I can eat the stuff and I can also sell the stuff. I do have intentions to selling this stuff. I might eat some of it. Sometimes getting the uh, thing to highlight what you want is a pain in the ass. Or I might have to sit. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. No, can I, can I? I gotta get up, I can't sit. Yeah, I'm just gonna step on the table to get it. Obviously, I shouldn't be doing this, but like I said, trying to get the things to highlight what you want is so annoying. And I just want to get moving. There's a bit of a delay too when you uh, click to pick it up. There's a bit of a delay. I don't think I can get these things. Let me see if you put crouch. All right, that's crouch. Okay. Some of this stuff is kind of like Skyrim. 
like the sneaking and stuff, that stuff reminds me of it in some of the other gameplay. But it's not fair to compare it to Skyrim either. I'm like, we'll open this. I'm not gonna take everything out yet, but I will. Later. Okay, I'm just gonna, again, like I said, I'm gonna just steal stuff. Volt takes stuff. There's nothing there. Jeez, by the time I get done with it, I might have to just eat the food. I'll be hungry again. Whoa. It's so hard to see. In the position I'm in. Okay, so we're gonna open. And we're just gonna take off. This will make more sense as the game goes on why I'm doing this now. And some people may consider this cheating, I just don't care. I've seen where I grabbed everything from. Okay. Nope, more thing. Okay. I don't think I have a lockpick yet. Let me see. No, I don't. And that shit took me ages to figure out. And it shouldn't have. But it did. Am I done? Am I done in here? Yeah, see, it says... Yeah, I'm done in here. Okay, now that I'm done stealing from my parents, I'm going to go along my merry way. And that's the door outside. That's... I got everything. Oh, wow, it opened. <laughs> it's open. Okay, and you will see the guard top, the apple. Um, if you look over to... The third number, 100, that shows how, how good the apple is. You go down here to the bread roll, and it shows 99. That shows that, you know, it's it's starting to go down, like the, uh, the freshness. So at some point, these things do rot. So at some point, you eat it or sell it or get rid of it. Oh, hi, Mom. I don't think I can say anything else to her, right? How are you, Henry? Is the brightness on this good? This brightness, holy shit. All right, now. Take let, me care. let me check the brightness. Mm -hmm. Well, let me leave the house, and I'll see if it gets any brighter. It should. There we go. Compass. Go to father. Okay. Yeah, we'll go to him. There is something I like to do. But I'll do that on I'll do that after this. Okay, this is the grindstone, this is where we work. And this is our father. What's the matter with you, Henry? Didn't you hear me calling you? This is where speech comes in handy. I'm not gonna read the whole thing, but basically based on the choices, based on your skill set will depend. If you're able to get a good conversation or not. If you persuade them to do what you want or, you know, convince them you're telling the truth when you're really lying or... It all comes into play. You'll see. I'm not going to read this whole thing. It's a lot to read. Okay, so of all of my options, you'll see the bottom left. You, you see what my stats are. But, we, you know, I don't know what my father's are, so... I don't know if I'm going to do a good job with what I pick. 
So I'm just gonna pick this middle one. It just seems like the safest. Sorry, Father. I was taking a stroll and lost track of time. Somehow I had a feeling I was seeing everything for the first time. How, my boy? When are you going to get some sense? Anyway, we've a lot of work to do today. I'm finishing the sword for Sir Radzik, and I need your help. With what? I'm running out of charcoal. Run to the market and buy a bag from the charcoal burner. I'll need some money then. Yeah, that's the other thing. Kunesh still owes me for an axe, a hammer, and the nails I sold him a month ago. Not to mention his debt from before. Go and tell him to pay up at least for oh. the axe and hammer, and then use the money to buy the charcoal. Kunesh, that drunkard. <laughs> That'll be fun. Well, you're a big lad now. I'm sure you can manage. If not, tell him that next time I'll come myself and personally use that hammer to bang those nails into his arse. <laughs> sure he'll be happy to hear it. Is that all? Not quite. The Chamberlain at the castle has the cross guard for Sir Radzik's sword, which I had engraved in Sassau. Do you want me to go and pick it up? All right. Money, charcoal, cross guard. Got it. And ale. <laughs> Stop off at the tavern on your way home. I know you'll be going there anyway to see that girl of yours. But make sure the ale's still cool from the cellar when you get back. Her name is Bianca. Right, so make sure Bianca draws me a nice cool one. <laughs> Run along now, work won't wait. Okay, so we actually have a lot to do. Okay. So there's a lot of different objectives. I wish it wasn't in white, the text. Hard to see. But anyway, so yeah, we have four to do. So let's open up the quest log. Well, that's the map. But yeah, so these are all the different things we have to do. A, E, C, and D. There is a B on there. He's hiding between A and E. So let's get... I always push the wrong buttons between the map and what I and the, the quest log. There we go. Hold on. I'm always pushing the wrong button. That's going to happen so much. Okay, yeah, so this is all the stuff we have to do. So. Oh, yeah, the sword fighting. All right, so we go to the sword fighting lesson. We have to buy charcoal. We have to collect the debt from Kunesh. We have to pick up the cross guard at the castle. And we have to buy ale. Ale we do last. Always. So let's just have a look around. This is am amazingly beautiful. That pop-up you saw during the conversation was to let me know another game downloaded. A Plague of Innocence, which is another game I will be playing. I played the demo for that. That was crazy fun. So I'm excited to play that as well. Okay, so... Let me see how much items I have, because there is a weight limit to what you can carry. So I'm allowed to carry, okay, on the very bottom. I'm basically allowed to carry seven, whatever the weight is, pounds, I don't know. And I have 46.1. Okay, let me take a look at it. Okay, I was gonna go talk to Kunish, but I'm thinking of selling the stuff. I'm just gonna sell this stuff for real quick. I don't Just know. A few small things. That's okay, these guys you sell to. Oh, he's a tailor. I don't think I can do it with this guy. Yes, okay, he's a tailor. So you have to find one that does food. Get out of the way. Oh, you're the blacksmith. Okay. You're food. You're the one I go to. God forbid I pick anything up, they'll think I'm stealing. Thanks. Rooms for your house, rakes and hoes, How are you? fields, what else do you need? Come this is also see. where speech comes in pretty good. You get more money. Okay, so let me go to sell. Okay, so, okay, I'm going to sell basically everything. Let me just 
Let's just sell the food. I don't want to sell my clothes. So let's sell the food. Urgh, okay. I'll sell 50. I'll keep two because I might eat them. I'll keep a cabbage too. I'll eat that also. Because my nourishment's already went down to 61 and before we got it up to 65. So it does go down at a good pace. That's all the carrots. I'll keep one cheese. I'll keep the soup for a moment. You can get full in this game. You can be stuffed. Also. So let's see. Okay, so at the top... Okay. So I'll start by selling this. Now I'm gonna haggle. I'm not gonna be that good in the beginning. About the price. Naturally. I already know all about this, so I'm just gonna skip this. You'll see as it goes along. Okay. So the bar up here. So this is really what it's worth. Obviously, I want it to be... Or, yeah, this is what it's worth. Okay, so since I'm selling, I want to get it for as much as possible. But I can already tell you, when you try to go too much, they get pissed and they don't deal with you anymore. Then the next time you go in, they'll offer you even less. So let's try to just be a little reasonable. We'll just go too higher. We agreed? I'd almost shake on that. Almost. Yeah, see, it's in the beginning especially, it's a lot harder. Now, I'm gonna try this and see if this works. You'll see the little, under under the scale, there's that face. It's in the yellow. I think that means that, you know, he, he hasn't lost his patience yet. At some point, they get impatient, and then you just, you're better off doing what they want. See, now I knew we'd come there we to go. Agreement. So I got a little bit more than what it was worth. Now I got some money. What can I, do for you? I am gonna eat. Yeah. Let me see something. Bear with me, let me see something. I'm gonna do something I probably shouldn't do. What I definitely shouldn't do. What's going on out there? Well, maybe not. Because she heard me. I'm looking... Sometimes outside there's another food pot. Even though you're really not supposed to. You can eat food out of someone else's pot. And if I'm able to do that and get my nourishment up, and then I can just sell more of the food. And get more, you know, so. I'm gonna try to do that. God save you too. This is very historically accurate, so religion is a thing in this game. This is where I wanted to go. I didn't mean to do this. Oh no, I didn't mean to do this. Yet. It was very important that I not do this. You can't be serious, Dutch. Insulting our king. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only... Ah, stupid of me. I had to. He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tatars and besiege Gutenberg. Why not? What is this Wenceslas for a king? The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. German counts, traitors. Now even the Pope. Pope be with you, Valerie. I'm with you, Matthew. What's going on here? Deutsches Fallen shit. What? Just listen and you'll hear for yourself. Someone has to bring order and reunite the empire. <laughs> Who do I care about the Austrians? And nowadays, not even the devil himself can keep up with all the popes. Which is the rightful pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. No, it's true, though. Wenceslas is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. Sir Radzik is Wenceslas' commander-in-chief. He stayed loyal to the king. And if he heard you talking like this, 
He would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to help your king. South Bohemia is with Sigismund. And don't and forget about Gutenberg, where Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. Yes, but Goodman Deutsch, this is pointless. Let us talk of more pleasant things. My words exactly. Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Deutsch is an idiot. But what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson. Doesn't he, Fritz? Too well, my view. Should give him a proper hiding. Are you mad? Do you want to end up in the pillory? Don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better idea. Deutsch was talking such shit, it made me think of that huge parlement You know, the one right next to his freshly whitewashed house. <laughs> you think we should redecorate for him? Count me in. Well, I'd rather touch it, to be honest. But, doing some tears will do. What do you say, Henry? But I was going to get ale for her father and a, a few other things. We're finishing Saratik's sword. Come on. Doing a few handfuls of manure is not going to take all day. And it's our duty to defend the honor of our king. So, how? Are you with us? I will do it. I don't like to do it. I'd prefer not to do it, but for the sake of showing you all, yeah, I'll do it. Oh, well. Father can wait a while. <laughs> My words exactly. I knew you wouldn't miss out on all the fun. Let's go. I'm going to pause real quick. Okay, turned my air conditioner off too while I was at it. Okay, let's see. I typically don't like to do this mission. It disappoints your father. I don't want to disappoint my father in this. Where'd they go? But it is funny. And I, I definitely didn't want to do this until after I talked to Kunish. I'll understand why. I'll explain it when we get to it, but basically... For the base, for the sake of story structure, it's better to first do that, then do this. I screwed up. We'll just have to make it work. Now we'll talk to Fritz. So are we doing this or not? Wait. We have to check that the coast is clear. Why? Deutsch is in the tavern. But maybe you noticed after all these years that he has a wife and a son. And that's a problem? Aye, it is. Henry, you go lure her away somehow. Why me? <laughs> because you're the clever one. Yeah. Alright, so let's go do this. Let's go talk to her. You hear the flies. I don't know where the... Oh, it's right here. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm right there. Yeah, not yet. We're gonna first talk to her. What do you want, lad? I just went by the tavern, and your husband was in there talking nonsense. I thought someone should take him home before he gets himself in trouble. What sort of nonsense? Well, uh... Well, he kept saying that Sigismund was right and King Wenceslas is a drunkard, that sort of thing. Some people took exception, so I thought... God almighty, the fool. <laughs> Next thing he'll start on about the popes. He might have mentioned the popes too. Thank you for telling me. I just hope I can catch him before he gets into another fight. Okay, so we did what we had to do. Game saved. That's one good thing. The saving mechanics in this is unique as well. Yeah, reputation was lost. That's another reason I don't want to do this. But, yeah. Ew. What are you waiting for, soldier? Fire the trebuchet! For king and country! For king and country, my ass! 
This is all good, clean, fun. <laughs> Nearly as good as having that traitor in the pillory. Nearly. Now that would be sweet. <laughs> That's for Sigismund. <laughs> Woohoo! Eat shit, doshes. You bastards! What the fuck do you think you're doing? <laughs> hey, Hans, can't you see? We're decorating your house for you. It's like your old man was saying in the tavern about that traitor Sigismund. We're just doing what we have to do. Oh, sons! <laughs> I'll make those smiles off your faces! Oh, I'd like to see you try. What are you doing here, Zbizhek? Hanging out with this poxy Deutsche? Maybe you'd like to try out the latest German fashion. Oof. <laughs> I forgot about that. Fuck her. I'll make you pay for that. <laughs> this part sucks, the fighting sequence, because you suck at fighting. In this game, you really start out as a no skills whatsoever. And, you know, when I was playing this game regularly, I was doing better. It's been a while, so I'm probably going to do a shit job right now. So let me look at the, in the controls. No, what's block? That's what's important, block. Okay. Oh yeah, locking. We'll try it, let's see. It's It doesn't matter if you win or lose. Yeah, see? Yeah, I suck. I'm gonna enjoy this. Oh, cool, he came to my rescue. Oh, yeah, I suck. I swear he only went down because Fritz helped me. Yeah, this guy screws me over later, so I kind of... So now we gotta run, and I don't remember how to run. I don't remember how to run. I don't remember how to run. How do I run? Am I running? Meet the lads at Kunish. See, that's the point you... Yeah, see... You really had to do Kunish first for it to make more sense. He basically causes trouble. And you're basically left having to walk away, but you get help. You ask them for help. As a matter of fact, if you do what you just did, and, you know, then in exchange they help Welcome, you. Henry. Welcome, welcome. Boom. <laughs> I don't think I'm running. I'm not running, wait. What's running? Oh, that's not running. So see, like, I don't know how this is going to work now with Kunesh, since I just did everything out of order. I'm just going to go straight to Kunesh and have the conversation without them. So that's where we came from, up there. So let's go to Kunesh right here. This, yeah, this is Kunesh's house, so let me have a conversation with him. God be with you, Kunesh. What do you want? My father sent me to get the coin you owe him for the axe, hammer, and nails. I've got nothing. Clear off. Okay, so pay you the lot or else. 
or pay for the tools at least. No matter what you say, you get the same answer, so I'm just gonna stick to my, uh, I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna. I knew you'd be trouble. Father says if you don't pay up, he'll come here himself and hammer those nails into your hairy ass. I'd like to see him try. Fuck off, you bastard, or your old man will be pulling those nails out of you. Again, it doesn't matter what you say, you end up with the same result. He doesn't do shit. He doesn't give you anything. He doesn't have anything. Look, I know things aren't easy. A wife ran off, booze is dear these days, and you're as much use as a square wheel. It's no wonder you're short of coin. But a debt's a debt, and I can't leave here without something. If I had anything to give, I'd give it. But I've got nothing. So leave me in peace, all of you. And don't come back. Yeah, see, it's considered a success because you're not really fighting him, but you could have been fighting him. And you suck at fighting. So, I can steal this. I just gotta wait for him to leave. I gotta make sure no one's watching. It's not, I don't, it's not stealing, though. Well, I guess it is. It's stealing. So I'm just gonna do it. Wait, where is he? You gotta do it right, because he can't be there, and no catch ball can be there. I guess I stole that. Everything else, it's just easier to get these guys to help you. Where are they? There they are. Good day, Henry. I'm glad you came. So ideally, you would have talked to Kunish. He wouldn't have given you anything. You then talk to these guys, and when you go along with them, you, you get them to agree to come here to help you. Obviously, things went out of order, but they're here anyway. Sucks of fits. Well, we sorted that Deutsch out. <laughs> that was pretty close, eh? That old bastard didn't stand a chance. True, but I'm worried that fucker Hans will snitch on us. Well, let him. Then I'll snitch on him. And anyway, what can they do to us for throwing a bit of dung? Good point. It's not as if anyone really likes the Deutsch. So, okay, so now you scratch my back. We sorted out Deutsch. Now I've got someone else to deal with. Another beating? <laughs> Count me in. Kunesh owes money to my father, but he won't pay. I'll have to shake it out of him. Sure, mate. You helped us, so we'll help you. Let's get to it, then. All right. <laughs> Um, okay, you were supposed to... I don't get that, but okay. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Kunesh, get out here, you old goat. I've something to show you. Yeah, I guess he's supposed to be inside, which is why we're in that position looking at... And then here he is. What the fuck are you here for? You want me to take a whip to you or call a catch pole? Just try it, you old drunk. Yeah, he's supposed to be in the house. This whole thing's... Oh, there we go. <laughs> Yeah! Yeah, I don't really have good blocking here. He kicked my ass. Enough! Enough! I give up! Take what you want. It's not much, but it's all I have. You understand? He almost makes you feel bad for taking it from him, but you, you, it's what has to be done. He definitely kicked my ass there, but the game progresses no matter what. At least now I can come in here and I'm not considered a thief. I can't see shit. That's the wrong way. That's 
it's also the wrong way. He really, he really doesn't have anything to give. Much. It's this way. It was this way all along. And there's nothing in there. I already know he doesn't have anything. Open. Wait, where the fuck is the... There we go. Yeah, I just opened it. Okay. So now I got everything. Okay, so now I got all of that stuff. Now I can do deal with the charcoal maker. Which is this dude? You, Hello. God be with you. Stop trade. Take care. Okay, so I need ten charcoal. I remember that. So let's add this. So I pay five, and I already got money for selling the food before. So I could just do that outright. But I want more money. Because I don't need this stuff. I don't think. I suppose you could keep the axe of the hammer for, like, weapons. Let me look, actually. Are they considered weapons? They're not considered weapons, so never mind. Okay, so I actually end up getting money out of the deal. Yeah, we'll do that. So, yeah, so... Yeah, that looks good to me. So let's, let's haggle. I always haggle. See if you get a little bit more. Let's have a word about the price. Why not? Okay, again, we're not gonna go too high because I guess they want he wants an even deal. Oh yeah, okay, so the uh it's based on 0. 0.5. And since I was gonna get 0. 0.2 it might have to I'll see if I can get a 0. 0.5, so I'm gonna go up to one and see if he'll meet me half uh, halfway. You okay, Winnie? It's my dog. Coffin. Satisfied? We're getting there. Just drop the price a bit more. I really hope he beats me. Okay, good. He met me there. So that, we'll we'll do that. Fair's fair. I still got better. I knew we'd come to an arrangement. Let me just stop real quick. Yep, she's coughing. I got a letter out of the room. Just realized it made more sense for me to move my face to this side since of the angle of which I'm looking down. Just looks better. So let's go. Oh, now my hat's all messed up. Oi! One second, everybody. Okay, I put my headphones back on and my hat was uh, all messed up. Couldn't see properly. Now we're good to go. So let's see where we are with quests. Wrong buttons again. So yeah, so we did A and C. We did C. A and C. Well, I don't remember what they were, actually. Oh, so we. So we got the. The lessons. Okay, we're doing the ale last. Oh, yeah, the charcoal was one and Kunesh was the other. So one was A, one was C. Sword fighting. I guess we get that out of the way. Let's get the sword fighting out of the way. So that's this guy. Hey, Pip! Do you oh, want to learn something? One minute. Let's get my nourishment up. I do this all the time. I'm always pushing the wrong buttons. So I'm gonna eat real quick. So let's eat the soup. It's up to 61. She's 71. That's a good one. 87. 89. That's a 91. Okay. Once you, once you go over 100, you actually start to feel sick. I'm sure you'll see that at some point. Have you recovered from yesterday's great wound? Oh, it was nothing. Except mother noticed and had a word or two to say about it. No mother's happy when a son starts to take an interest in swords. Where there's weapons, there's death. The question is, what do you want? 
I don't want to rot in this hole forever. I feel like I don't belong here. I want to live and see the world. The world's a dangerous place and I need to know how to protect myself. Spoken like a man. And as it happens, today's your last chance. I have to leave. So, are you ready to get stuck in? Let's go. Yes. All right, I wait on the ground by the sheepfold as usual. Now this game can be very realistic, especially when it comes to combat. Like, you're just a blacksmith's son, and it treats you like a blacksmith's son. I, guess, I think I go this way. I know I go there, okay. So you don't have training, so in combat, you suck at combat in the beginning. You gotta actually learn as you progress in the game. And it can be very challenging, but very rewarding when you finally do good. I'm gonna wait here for him. There he is. I thought he was coming that way. Oh, he's coming this way. I love the music. I look, I look at all out there, like all this out there. Yeah, like, good that I'm showing you this. Like, that, you're gonna, all the, the smoke, you'll find out very soon what's going on with that. And then look at all this. This is so beautiful. I love this game. Right, let's get this over with. So. Can we get started? Yes. We can. Good. And since today's the last time we'll be seeing each other, you can show me everything I've taught you so far. Very well. Let's start with the basics. Keep moving. Your life depends on it. Oops. I did the very thing I didn't want to do. Ah, stop it. All right, all right. Now try to hit me. You have to put your weight into your attack. If you just fiddle around, you'll get nowhere. Try slashing from different sides. Unpredictability is the key. Never repeat yourself. Okay, wait. Now let me look. All right, there we go. Okay. I was... I'm re oh, reading the one side and looking the wrong way. That's why you saw the blades for stabbing. Tried a few times. All right, that's very good. Not bad. Good. Very good. Good, good. Let's try something else. One strike, I can fend off without a sweat. But if you chain your strikes, I'll have a much harder time. As soon as you land one blow, follow it with another. Now you're getting it. Yeah, when you go gray, I think your stamina goes. Yeah, it goes down. You'll see that yellow bar on the bottom. That's your stamina. Very good. There we go. enough. I don't know about you, but I'm tired and thirsty. Remember though, train hard. No one becomes a master swordsman overnight. You have to work and work. And the main thing is to use what you've learned in real combat. There's nothing better than experience, believe me. Oh shit, am I recording? I am recording, good. Good. Let's see what I got. So that's everything. So Groshin, that's what the money's called, Groshin. I don't need that anymore. I'll hold on to them for a little while longer, but I don't really need them anymore. Okay, 
so let me look at this. There's two more things to do. Okay, so it's get the AL. I'm going to do that last. Pick up cross. Okay, so I'm going to do the cross guard right now. That's this way. I don't remember, though, about the running. I don't remember how to run. That's definitely not it. Whoa. That's... Nice guy. Nice guy. Let's just see. Look at all those trees. Like, this whole area is so cool. Okay, here's where we're going for this. Hmm. Which one do I want to talk to? You got the crest. I'll be with you. I'm with you, Henry. How are you? Now let's have a little conversation. I've just been to the tavern. The Deutsch was saying all kinds of shit about how Sigismund should be king. That bastard. One day he'll get his teeth knocked down his throat if he doesn't shut up. Father sent me. We're forging a sword for Sir Radzik, and the Chamberlain has the cross guard and pommel. Father had them engraved in Sassau. Right. They're here. The Chamberlain gave them to us for you. We looked them over. Beautiful work. I've never seen anything so fine. I can't wait to see the sword. Just make sure you don't botch it. And did I ever botch anything? Where shall I start? Uh -huh. Ah, shut uh -huh. up and give me what I want, or I'll kick your ass this evening. Right away, your lordship. Magnificent. Shame I can't keep the sword for myself. Well, I better go if we're to get the job done by this evening. Godspeed. See you later in the tavern. You certainly will. After today's work, the ale might even be on me. Okay, good. So we only have one more thing to do, and that's the ale. Come on, button again. So it's just the ale. Okay. Let me just look at... I do want to look at my items now that I'm thinking about it. I ate all the food. Okay, good, 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 good. I am going to do something. And it's probably going to be considered cheating. I don't care. Because it does help me with the game. And since I'm not just playing the game for fun, I'm also showing you the game. I want to do a good job during the game. So it's good for me to get a leg up wherever I can. So, okay. I'm going to start up here just because this is like a, a top corner. So, it's dark, though. That part's dark. I'll just show you here. So, little tip. If you want to take the time, you can pick these up. And gather them. And as you gather them, hopefully something will pop up soon once I do a few of these. You actually get skill points. See. Actually, get a skill point. Any minute now, I'll get a skill point. There we go. You've reached a new level in herbalism. So that's a new level. So let me see if I can get there from here. That's a codex. That's an interesting read. You ever play the game? It's very interesting to read. I'm not reading all of that here. That's the map with the quests. Quest log. We were there before. Player. This is where I want to be. Okay, went all the way around for nothing. 
Okay, so here's the stats. You can see we have, you know, different combat skills. Skills, these, this is what I wanted to look at. So that's all the stats, and this is, speech is very important. You can even, like, here, yeah, it explains to you the importance of all this stuff. And how much progress you're at to, before you get to the next level, so that's pretty cool. And you can watch that and manage it. It's skills, so we're at herbalism. So this is important to me. Uh, let me see what button do I want to look for again. Okay, so you get perks based on how many levels you, you go up. So at level 5, I'm going to get a perk. And I want these perks now. So these are the perks you can get. Right now, these four. So let's see, flower power is... You get two charisma points if you have a certain amount of fragrant herbs in your inventory. Um, this one is... Your horse is less shy. That one I don't think matters that much. That's not a priority, that one. So the first top one is a, is a priority because your charisma goes up. It helps you along the way. The herbs will sell... Oh, the herbs you sell have. All right, this is another good one. You know, 15% higher price. So then as you sell herbs, you get more money. That's a good one to have. This is another good one, though. This is a big one to me. The herb picking activity will add experience to your strength stat as well. So that's once you get... You need a minimum level of 10. So good news, there's enough herbs in this entire beginning area. If you have the patience... To get up to that high. I think I can get up to a level 11. The problem is, it's going to take probably... Maybe two hours. I don't know. So at this point... What I'm going to do... Is turn this off. Because I'm not going to have you guys sit here and watch me do a two hour video of me picking flowers. Especially since half the time they don't highlight properly. Not all these flowers can get picked up, by the way. These blue ones can't be picked up, and I forget that every time I play. But some of these yellow ones can. So anyway, I'm not going to have you guys watch me do it. And again, you might consider that cheating to do that. Um, but for the sake of doing a good job in this Let's Play, because I'm going to suck enough on my own, I'm, I'm going to do whatever I can to get ahead. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to come back here in a little bit. And by the time you see me, I might come back right when I get the first perk just to show you guys. We'll see how it goes. But you won't see me for a little while. Okay. Well, you'll see me right away with the editing, but I'll see you guys shortly. Hi, I'm back. I got stuck in a fence and video game glitch logic. I couldn't move and had to start all over again. I started right at fighting those people like those guys and running away from them then had to do the sword fighting again and fighting kunesh and all of that so herbalism is at a level seven now you get a perk at level five i completely forgot about that I, I forgot to check to see where i was so i'm already made it up to level seven i have a perk so obvious okay so the two that you're allowed to get now are these two, Flower Power and Horse Snip. Flower Power is the one I want. Again, it's if you have enough fragrant, or fragrant herbs in your inventory, you get 2% Charisma bonus. There, I don't remember the difference between Speech and Charisma, but if you look at the screen right now on the very bottom, bottom right, you'll see Charisma and Speed are the two bottom ones, bottom right. Speed's pretty good, actually. Wow. Anyway, Charisma's at a level 6. So watch what's... I don't know if actually I have any fragrant herbs on me. We'll find out in a minute. So Flower Power. We're going to select that. Do you really want to learn this perk? Yes, I do. Now, it's blue, and I'm at a level 8. It's important to have that. I do know that. Oh, what did I do? So, I am recording, right? If I said all of this, I'm going to be so pissed if it was for nothing. 
Okay. So. Trying to see if I can find the difference between charisma and and speech. Maybe this will tell me. Duh, I should have done this first. Yeah, speech gets you out of situations, which, like I said, was very important. Why can't I do the right button? All right, charisma is a measure of how you can impress people. Oh, yeah, if you look a certain way, talk a certain way, act a certain way, people like you more. Oh, the music just kicked back on. Whereas speech has to do with the actual conversation. Okay, so. You do get perks in speech. Your charisma just go, oh my god. Yeah, so, okay, so right now that's up. So the, you actually get perks and stuff with the speech. The charisma you don't. But the charisma just has to do with, like, the way people uh, judge you. Whereas speech actually is based on how well you speak to people and how well you can get yourself out of situations. But either way, both are very important. You will see that as we go along. Another thing I wanted to say, while I am picking flowers, I'm wasting a lot of time walking around that the game obviously didn't intend for you to do in this part of the game. And I will say that, show you this. Your shoes, just like how the, the food rots, your shoes and such can get worn out too. So now my boots, my old boots are at a level 91. I just unequipped them. Wait, okay. Yeah, so I just unequipped them. So now I'm barefoot. I'm gonna do that while I walk around to do the rest of this, because I wanna get to a level 10 herbalism. So I still have three more levels to go. I don't wanna waste the shoes on that, because I need this stuff to last until I can upgrade to better stuff. I should have done that from the beginning. I screwed up, but I remember now, so at least for the rest of this, I can do that. And also, as you go up to higher levels, you see, you see I'm barefoot. Like before when you're on level one, you pick up one flower and it'll just pick up that one flower. As you go higher up with your skill, it'll actually pick up ones around that. So of the same flower. So you'll see these are here are the same Valerian flower. Now level one, it would have just picked up this one. I'm at level seven now. And as you can see, it got all of those that were the same flower. It didn't get all of them as you go higher up you will get more it will take more at once which if you're just trying to grab flowers in a rush that's helpful but for right now when you're trying to build up your stat it kind of sucks because i don't think i don't think it makes your experience uh points go up any higher if it grabs more so i think you have to do it more often um anyway i'll come back again after I get up to at least level 10 so that I can then get the strength one where uh, every, you know after you get that every time you pick up flowers your strength goes up too I think that's what it said anyway I will be right back you get it? Okay, I will be back okay hello so I am back I am not quite there yet I am still at yeah I'm only at level Level 9. I'm almost there then. I'm actually almost there, so maybe we'll just continue on. We'll see how long that takes. And if I can fill the space with the way I'm... With, uh... Anything I can say. Now, I already got the overloaded message. I am over-encumbered. I have more stuff than I can carry. You can see on the bottom, um... On the very bottom, towards the left, 76.6 .6 out of 74. I can only have 74 weight whatever the weight is it's probably not pounds but i only know pounds so i'll say weight or pounds um so i'm only allowed 74 i'm already at 76.6 because i crap so much flowers 
So I'm gonna go sell them to get some of the it back, but um, I'm so close actually that I might just go until I get to a store. You can even see on the bottom screen, you see like the red is my health, that bar, and the yellow is my stamina. And then you can see a little picture next to it of a guy like holding something like a you know, big giant weight on his back. That's the signal that, hey you guys. Oh, I'm oh I'm right where I wanna be. That's the guy like that that's the symbol that I'm over encumbered. I don't know if I can sell flowers to this guy. God be with you. I got 20 charcoal. I only needed 10. I had to redo all that, by the way. I think I said that already. I had to. Oh, I'm bought. That, that's under buying. My bad. I only had to. Yeah. So, yeah, I had to redo all of that type of stuff. Because when I went to collect flowers the first time, I got glitched up and stuck in place. So, I couldn't move. I had to restart all that again. So, I had to do the charcoal again. But no, I was that was under buy. I made that mistake. So, now, so I can sell this stuff. Good. I don't need that. Oh, what I do? I did something. Anyway, so I'm gonna sell all. I'm not gonna sell all of it. If you re I, if you have a certain amount of fragrant fragrant herbs, you get a good bonus. That um. Plus two charisma. I don't remember which ones are considered fragrant. Fragrant. I'm pretty sure chamomile is. So I'm gonna keep ten of those. I think you have to have 30 fragrance, so I'll keep 10 of those and 10 of other ones. Like, I'm pretty sure sage. Because I don't know, I'm not good with this sort of thing. I usually just keep 10 of everything, unless I know for sure it's not. Anyway. I'll just keep 10 of everything anyway, just because I know. Like, at some point, that stuff's gonna come in handy. It doesn't come in handy yet. You do make stuff with this, with the flowers. It's not gonna happen anytime soon, so I really don't need to hold on to it. The dandelions, I don't have to hold on to at all. I'm pretty sure. Like, at least stuff I might have. I'm not gonna be doing any of that potion making or anything anytime soon, so I really don't need this stuff. I just need enough to... Keep the charisma bonus. There we go. So I got ten of everything now. And okay, ooh, that sucks. This sucks because we can all everything I have is worth seventy-four groschen. His maximum wealth is fifty-four, so that's twenty. And I didn't notice that while I was doing this. So I might have to take some off, or I can see if I can buy anything from him that I may want. I don't think I want anything. Ooh, I might. Now that I'm looking at it, I might. All right, the blacksmith's kit or the cobbler's kit. I might get one of those. What else does he have? I can get a torch anywhere. That's too much. I might buy that. What does that do again? The anecdote? Oh, it's strictly to poison. Where's the, um... Yeah, I might get wine or food or something. Oh, the dried stuff is good. Because that's food that never goes bad. Water is good to have, too, because you do have to deal with all of that. Well, then... Is that what I think that is, what I need? I know that's not what I, there's something else that I wanna get. These, that's too much money. They're very important. That's how you save your game. That's how you save your game. It is. Let me, let me just get some of this stuff then. Okay, so now I only... Right, so I gotta get that down a little bit more. So if I can just make this even, I'll just make this even. Cheap wine. I might... 
You bring it, yeah, drinking alcohol does bring your energy down, but, uh, it does give you some nourishment, some of this stuff does. The water, do I really want the water? It doesn't bring your nourishment up that much. <clears throat> Excuse me. Was there regular wine? There we go. So that's nourishment for t 15 nourishment, 2 health, minus 2 energy. What was fine wine? All good. Alright, we're going for that one. Now I get 40 So now we're in the good. Now we're good. Let me see, can I sell anything else? No, I think we're good with that. I was gonna try to make it as even as possible, but you know, I'm not gonna waste my time. I think we're good with that. So I'm getting those things, which will come in handy later. The dried food and the wine, that'll come in handy later. And I'm selling all those flowers. I'll haggle. I'll see if I can get a little bit more. Can we do something about the price? Why not? You can get 45. I'll go for his max at 54. He's not going to go for it. We'll see if we can meet at 50. Are we agreed? I'd almost shake on that. Almost. If you go too high, they get pissed. There. Oh, I'm. A oh, that happened too fast. That it went in increments of five, so at 54. Then when I went down, pushed it down to go down, it went straight to five instead of meeting him. At so I settled for less. I settled for one groschen less. Forks and axes, all you need to tame Mother Nature. Kiss my butt. Anyway, so. I'm almost at the level 10, so I'm going to do a little bit more. But to show you what I was originally going to show you, way back before any of this happened, somewhere around here there is a cooking pot. And you can eat the cook, uh, eat out of anybody's cooking pot. You probably get yelled at. I never stick around long enough to find it out. Somewhere around here there's going to be a cooking pot. Oh, this is cool. You can wash yourself. You wash yourself as much as you can. So, that's pretty cool, I think. Look at all that. Look at all of that out there. Oh, this is her house. She should have a cooking pot. Hey, Henry's come to see us. Who said that? He wouldn't have said that, would he? You can't leave this section, by the way. It's all enclosed. Ooh, I could pick up. A I don't think I can pick these up, actually. No, I can't. I can pick those up. I'm going to soon. Pick up more stuff. And once you pick up some these flowers, they do come back. Let me pick them up while I talk. Get my skill up. These flowers eventually do come back. I've heard. I don't. You don't really stick in this area too much. And I really haven't come back here all that much once you're, like, finally out of it. So I don't know, but I think, like what I've heard, that these do come back. I haven't beaten this game. I've played a decent amount. I haven't completed it. I figured I'll start this Let's Play, and eventually I'll be on to fresh new stuff, and you guys can see genuine reactions for it. This early stuff, I already know what's going to happen. I'm not going to have any type of shock or wonder. But I will. As I progress further than, than I went already. But I got a decent amount, I think. I think I got a pretty decent amount into it. I th yeah, I can pick you up. Come on. Highlighting things sucks in this game. I don't know if it's, ooh, uh, oh, there we go, I'm at level 10. I don't know if it's because of, uh, I'm on a PlayStation and not a computer. I'm not good at computer games. I'm not good with computers. 
Okay, so... Oop. So I did get the, uh... One perk. Ooh, there's a resistance? What is that? I've collected such a quantity of poisonous herbs or nettles. Alright. You've collected such a quantity of poisonous herbs or nettles that your vitality is permanently increased by plus two. I did forget that. And I remember seeing that at one point. But not, as I'm reading it, I remembered it. So that's cool. It's permanently up now. So now I permanently have this perk uh, with my vitality being up. And if I can find out how to see what a vitality is, because I forgot, determines how much character you, how much a character can endure. Stamina, the more stamina, the faster it regenerates. Okay, all that stuff. So, so that's cool. It's got a permanent perk. I did forget about that. So anyway, so the cool thing is once you've earned, um, let's see. So yeah, I get perks at levels five, 10, 15, and 20. But see, hold on, let me see something. So I got flower power. I don't think this wasn't what I wanted. Yeah, I didn't care so much about this with the horse. And the price does matter. But right now I'm going to focus on this one, leg day. Because every time I pick up herbs now, um, I'm going to get extra experience, uh, strength experience too. So to me, that's important. So I'm going to select that right now. I'm not going to waste And then, in another five, what was it, five, ten, fifteen. So in another five levels, I'll be able to come back and get one of these other two. I'd go for botanist, and then I'd finally go for horse nut. But right now, I got exactly what I wanted out of this. So I'm gonna go back and sell. So it wasn't quite the two hours I thought it. I thought it was. It must have just taken me two hours the one time because I was must have been doing other things. It's a good thing I washed myself after all the shit that I threw. I mean, jeez, I should have done that right away. They should have shown that in the game. Look at all that beautiful landscape. Look at all that. And it, it is open world we will be able to explore. I still quite can't figure out how to run. Maybe I just can't do it yet. People do get mad when you trespass, but they're not mad now. Ooh, I can rob them. Okay. We're doing it. I don't condone thievery in real life, but in a video game. It's actually good that I'm showing you this because now you can see what happens when I try to sell something that I that was stolen. May the Lord watch over you, Henry. Oh, you're so nice. Very religious. Very religious. You're Alex. Alex is the brother of somebody. And he's the bailiff. I don't think this will trigger a cutscene, but this is where you go to get the ale. The game got, God damn, the game got dark. That's Bianca. That's your girlfriend. I will come, I will come back to you. Okay, there's nothing up here. I'll put his shoes back on eventually. Trust me, I will. This is where she works. This isn't where she lives. See, now you're trespassing. You can actually get in trouble. If you don't leave in time, the guard comes and gets mad at you. You get in trouble. I'm not going to steal anymore. I could, but I'm not going to. Okay. Yeah, let me just go sell this stuff real quick. I'm all over the place, I know. So let me go to the... Okay, I pretty much took all their money. 
I don't think they have enough to sell me anything else. Or f to, for me to sell to them. Okay, so they have five. Okay, so. Okay, so that adds a basket. Okay, I'm gonna try to sell all ten. Now watch this. Do you want to get me in trouble? Don't try selling me stolen goods. Most places won't accept stolen goods. I happen to know. Fresh vegetables. Look, Where is she? Smell. Aren't they lovely? She won't either, I don't think. I don't remember. But I know for a fact this lady does. So you can sell to some Don't traders. Oh, that's my mom, I think. Oh, no, that's a trader. She's not going to be my mom. Good health to you. Some traders you can sell stolen goods to. But you don't get what you want for it. Like, it's worth $3. I ain't getting 3 This is a very dubious business indeed. I won't give you much for that. As long as we can both agree on the price. Yeah, because she knows it's stolen. So that's... That might piss her off. That's kind of a lot. We'll see what she says. What do you say to this? We're getting there. Just drop the price a bit more. Okay. So there you That's go. That's a sum so, I can live with. Typically, she straight up says she won't that because it's stolen, she won't give you a lot. She didn't say those words this time. So how am I looking? Okay. I forgot to actually go in and sell the herbs. I'll keep them, because I only have two of them. And I'll keep them, because I only have five of them. Oh, right for it. Oh. Let's have a word about the price. I'm rec Naturally. recording, right? I am recording, right? Excellent, I'm recording. Okay. Let's go for an even six. I don't think you'll do it, but... Since it's you. I'd almost shake on that. Almost. That's a sum I can live with. Okay, so now I think I'm doing better. Already. So what's left to do? Just the ale, right? I could have kept picking the um the flowers and such. I, want, I just want to get into it. So I'll do the ale in just a minute. I'm gonna do a really quick look around. We already saw up that way. Like just how cool all this looks. And even back there, further back there. I don't know if you can kill the animals, I don't remember. Oh, this is cool. Okay, I wanted to talk to her anyway. I like having a conversation with her before you get to the, uh, finishing these quests. Henry, what do you need, son? Oh, it's just the same conversation? I don't remember. Oh yeah, I remember now. If any of those people injure you when you fight them, you can go back to your mom and complain that you got hurt and she makes it all better and your health goes up. Oh, here's another one. I can eat out of this one too. So my health is now at an 86. My nourishment is now at an 86. There's a difference. I just thought this was cool. 
I, I can't walk over that, apparently. Anyway, up here. You look, you look through the little holes and you can see... I, this is the dumbest thing that I waste the time to go show you. And then you come... Yeah, you just like... I just think that it's so cool that it, it actually gives you that detail. It's not the most far out thing I've ever seen. I'm not getting a good angle. There we go. That's... There we go. Oh, there we go. You can see all the smoke on that house down there, and that's probably the better hole to look through. There we go. Oh, I just thought that was really cool. You can see it that way. Anyway, that's all I wanted to show you up here. And I love the designs of the homes. I just love the whole medieval period. Yeah, they look at all that out there. Like, look at all that out there. Oh, this music. This is like that sad, sappy, but peaceful music. Where am I trying? I'm trying to get. All right, there we go. Like all that out there. That's all out of scallops. Um, that's a way out, but you can't get out yet. You're stuck in here. Until you tr you trigger it. We'll move on now. Okay, we'll go to deal with Bianca, the girlfriend. Now that I've pretty much done everything I have to do. I've always done the ale. Oops. I've always done the ale last because he mentioned, the dad mentions how he wants it cold. I don't know if it gets warm after a while, so I always just do it last. <laughs> It is the last thing I have to do. May the Lord watch over you, Henry. Mm, I think you, can you go in this? Yeah, you can come down in here. Again, I could steal. I'm not going to. Without further ado, speak to the lovely Bianca. God save my lovely. You're looking well today. <laughs> you too, handsome. What brings you here? You do. Your beauty, of course. <laughs> oh, noble sir. I'm as honored as any simple maid can be. And a cart for my beauty? What else might your worship desire? Yeah, let's keep the conversation going as long as possible. It's not gonna take that long. The Deutsch is mouthing off again. Oh, don't talk to me about him. He's a good customer, but when it comes to politics, he's unbearable. The number of times I had to throw him and the others out so they wouldn't start brawling. Well, I'd say he's in exceptional form today. Now we go on. I need ale for father. A pitcher as usual? Aye. Bring me a cool one from the cellar. <laughs> but of course. Here you are. Thanks. It's on me today. <laughs> you can pay me back this evening. Out of the question. Here you go. And this evening I'll have something more for you. <laughs> I can't wait. Thanks. You'll have something to look forward to this evening. <laughs> you too. Oh, um, by the way, that shifty-looking fellow was asking after you. Vanya? I suppose. He's a man who makes his coin robbing honest wayfarers. I'm sure of it. I'll be happy when he's gone for good. But what in heaven's name are you up to with him? Uh-oh. He promised to teach me how to use a sword. What use would that be to you? Enough. You sound just like father. I'll be going now. See you this evening. Hal, I've got something special for you. Is that so? Oh. Now what would that be? There we go. Your favorite, savior schnapps. Really? 
You're an angel. <laughs> I hope you'll thank me properly later. You bet I will. Yeah, saving the game. Oh, wait, 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 don't move. So you save the game when you sleep in a bed and all these other things, but if you need to save immediately and you're not going to be able to sleep in a bed or anything, you have to use these schnapps. Once you're out, you can't save the game immediately. Let's go. I don't think you can say anything else to her anyway. Look at you, lover boy. Ooh. Yeah, that's it. I'm not gonna trade with her. Let's get back home now. I don't think I'm forgetting anything else. I think I'm done. Yep. Time to go back home. Overall, I'm in pretty good shape. Hey. This intro is taking longer than I expected. I ended up dividing this intro into three parts. In later episodes, you even hear me talking about whether it's going to be one part or two parts. It's three parts. I did want to make it all one big long episode, but that's four hours, and I didn't think that was right, so I just divided it. The introduction to this game just takes so long because it, there's so many cutscenes and there's a lot going on, which you will see as we progress. That's it for now. I hope you had a great time. Have a good day. See you next time.